Welcome back everybody to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. Welcome back to exploring the world of Azeroth and World of Warcraft. Today's adventure leads us to Trisfall Glades up in the uh, Eastern Kingdoms up north where uh, we are very close to Death Canal uh, where the undead start and their spawning zone. Um, but we are in the lake right next to that up here. And uh, if you come up to this lake, you would nor normally see a um, like kind of like a twilight hammer set up over here. Or twilight uh, enforcers. I don't know, whatever you want to call them, right? Now, if you come into this water, there is a giant facility right here. Or hole in the ground with a covering on top of it. And you may be wondering, what the heck is that? Well, that is part of... Uh, it was part of Legion. It was uh, only a place where priests can get inside, but... Because we uh, break out of bounds and because we break things in World of Warcraft, <laughs> we're going to be getting in there and I'm going to show you how. All this credit goes to Trent. If you haven't met Trent, he is in the Discord for ATN. Really nice guy. I hope you can talk with him. And uh, he's the one that actually gets all the credit for this and had showed me how to break in. So thanks, Trent, for this video and uh, appreciate you, man. Um, so I'm going to be showing you how to get in here. So uh, the way that you do it is you swim under here right next to the structure now when you get up to the structure what you're going to want to do is kind of swim under this way and you're just going to want to place your cushion and then uh you're just going to want to jump on top of it now there you go boom you're inside now this is kind of the tricky part because you kind of got to maneuver so what you want to do is swim up just a little bit and then go forward here and then you should be able to get in it's a little tricky at first Kind of get in. Oh, okay, we got stuck. So let's try it again. This takes a little bit of maneuvering. I've only got in like one time. So what we're going to do is we're going to maneuver around here. And let's see here. Because the problem is you kind of get stuck uh, inside of the wall. So if you don't do it, you know, how you're supposed to, it's not going to work. Um, there we go. I think we got it. Yep. All right. We're in. So there you go. You kind of got to maneuver around and swim straight through. So we are currently in. So let's go check this place out. This is called the uh, secret passage or underwater passage. I apologize. And uh, in this underwater passage, you're going to see some really cool things that normally you're supposed to be a priest. Like I said, you can't get in here normally. So, but we're a demon hunter and we're going to get in anyways. This is what we do. <laughs> Ah, this is really cool. So we got another underwater cave. Wow, this is amazing. I love the architecture in here. Very tight and reminiscent in here. Wow, this is awesome. We're going to fly forward. And we're going to jump down here. Let's go check this place out more. I'm going to give you guys a better view. Zooming in. This would make some cool photography in here. Now this seems like an ancient cavern or a cave. And if people know the lore and backstory, I would love to hear it. Because you know me, I'm not great with lore, so I'm still learning. Ah, now this is really cool. So I'm assuming this looks like a prison. Um, Trent had explained to me earlier about what had happened here. I kind of forgot. Sorry, Trent. <laughs> I apologize. Uh, I need to do a little more research next time, but this is really cool. It's like a holding cell. Wow. Look at these shackles. They're like see-through. Spirit-proof. Yeah, if you guys haven't come down this place, it's really cool. So let's go to the Tomb of Tyr. Or Tyr. Tyr. I don't know. Whatever you want to say. It's up to you. Now, I don't think you can go too much places in here. It looks like stuff. Definitely don't want to fall down there, because I'm assuming you would just die. But this place is awesome. We're going to take another screenshot here. And we're going to come back this way. 
Oh, my uh, Nogger potion ran out because we were breathing underwater with the skeleton. I didn't want to lose my breath. But we're going to head back up this way. I'm going to zoom back in and show you the kind of the architecture of this room. Yeah, if you guys haven't ever been this place, this is really cool. I definitely recommend coming in here and checking it out. And if you want to get back out, it's as simple as swimming back up to the surface. And just putting down your pillow or couch cushion, whatever you got. And uh, swimming back out again. And that's it. Not too hard. Uh, and I'll show you how to do that real quick. Let's go out this way. We're going to keep swimming. We're going to get our couch cushion over here. And there you go. We're back out again. So simple as that. But this place is really cool. Definitely come check it out. It's the Tomb of Tyr. Ty Tyr. Whatever it's called. <laughs> I know a lot of Lao Allure experts are going to be correcting me here, but that's okay. But anyways, guys, I appreciate all the support you guys have been showing. I got a really special video coming up uh, that I'm going to be posting. And uh, definitely stay in tune for that. So anyways, guys, as always, my name is Nathan. I'll catch you on the next one. Take care.